Hi all, welcome back. So today I think we are going to learn something different, uh, which is mostly on uh, uh, training the model, right? So uh, to train the model, uh, you need to have certain set of uh, prerequisites. Maybe like uh, you need to have something called as data sets, right? You need to have a good number of data set which you wanted to train it. Maybe like for images, if you take an example of images, you need to have like around 20 to 40 images where you wanted to train it out, right? And then you need to have a uh, account created in two different locations one is hugging face right so hugging face is something like uh, uh, similar to github where you have many people have trained their model and added their uh, related part and the second one is replicate okay so this replicate is where uh, you can have uh, a different set of uh, models and that is morally on by the uh, a black forest for the uh, LoRa model. LoRa model is morely on Dow LoRa. You usually call as the Dow LoRa, and that also you have different versions, 1.1 and other set of versions. So uh, I pick uh, usually Dow LoRa 1.1. Uh, and uh, uh, when you have this uh, replicate uh, account created, you, it will also have the the basic building related part also at the very initial point of time. Uh, you can create an account and then you can feed your uh, credit card number and uh, whenever you train a model it will be mostly of like uh, a, a dollar or two dollar which will be like uh, 80 rupees or uh, 160 rupees right whenever you train a new model it will charge you 86 rupees as per the currency as of now and uh, whenever you generate a new image it would be hardly like uh, very less like 0.1 cent or 0.2 cents right or roughly like uh, 10 rupees or 20 rupees okay so now uh, let us dive into the hands-on and see through what all the different things we can do it out okay step one uh, step one is like uh, you need to have a set of photos where you have a very good uh, high shots and uh, different angles in different part like if you have around 30 to 40 photos it would be nice and you have to create a data set uh, in such a way and give some name like i've given something like uh, darwin is the one name and uh, you have to zip it out uh, this particular part once uh, you think of the data set is done right this is the first step now the first step is completed you have created the data set now second thing is like uh, you have to go ahead and create a uh, hugging face account okay so usually you, if you go to hugging face you can go ahead and log in and sign up a related part and once uh, you are signed up i think uh, uh, the hugging face account is done right now uh, you also have to go ahead and create a uh, replicate account okay so this is the replicate account and if you go over here uh, you can go over here and create an account usually you have to also provide the pricing details also so pricing details you may have to provide a credit card number uh, and a related part where you can uh, get it out related uh, information so that uh, the billing can start uh, only when you have the billing only uh, it, uh, it it charges right so now you have different public models now you have something like anthropic cloud a 3.7 sonnet and you have like uh, flux 1.1 pro flux dow right deep sea car one flux channel and uh, you also have vo2 uh, vo3 is also available i think uh, from google recently uh, but however uh, but this flux 1.1 is ultimate from the black forest it it gives very realistic photos right and you also have many of uh, different models which are present as of now uh, as of okay now now the second part is you have to create an account in the hugging face account in the replicate and also handle the pricing details right now let's let us go to the third step okay so in the third step what you have to do is you have to go to the hugging face and then you have to click on uh, your profile and click on new model okay so now when i say new model and then i can uh, give some different names so here uh, you can say as like uh, uh, maybe the model name which i wanted to give is like uh, you can give like uh, uh, something like i have given something as my own uh, re related name and also you can say as public so once you have say pub uh, public and then you can go ahead and create a model okay so it will go and create a repository right it is just like a repository creation you have created a repository and in the repository once you train the model right it will move all set of uh, information onto this repository 
so that uh, so let us let us it create a uh, model now what we will do so we will go to the replica okay replicate right now here when you go over the replicate you also have something called as uh, uh, models and then you can uh, you can go for a training models so usually you have something called as uh, uh, training models which were already present uh, you can use one of the training models uh, which are already there maybe i will list ostris flux dowlorum trainer okay so you have to train that particular uh, model okay then only you will be able to uh, create rest of things now what you have to say is once you have done right you can go ahead like for example once this uh, uh, repository is created you can go ahead and copy the repository name and then copy over uh, here saying like create new model and then say uh, you can paste it out okay so you can just say you can just uh, paste it out over here saying that uh, uh, maybe like uh, you can just give the name you can just give the name and then you can uh, select a private model okay and then you can just select uh, the images right you can just select the images which you have done you can drag and drop the zip file okay so once you drag and drop over the zip file uh, it will take all the related part now here what i will do is i will uh, uh, give a trigger word so trigger word is like uh, the gap so i can say like uh, uh, whenever you use that word in the prompt it goes and uses that data set right it goes and uses that particular data set now if i save over here like i will say like uh, pinto okay so now i will uh, say it out i usually uh, and then you can also give the steps like uh, 2000 which is more uh, nearly related part right so that will be suitable for uh, getting the realistic images now you have to give the hf repo id and hf token okay this is the most crucial part but you have to be very careful when you are creating this part so when you are creating hf repo id so you have to go over here and then uh, uh, get the profile you can take a copy of that one and then you can paste it out over here okay so once you have done you, uh, the token is something like you have to go and generate a token right so now you have to go over here and then go to settings okay so now and then you have to go to access tokens okay so now here you have to create a new token and uh, add it out over uh, in the location maybe i will just say like uh, create token and then i will say like uh, token name as uh, pinto okay select all these information okay so it will uh, go ahead and write all the set of information okay now once this is done you go over here billing and everything it will be done okay so you go ahead over here and then say create token so make sure uh, you copy this uh, token id and uh, uh, once again otherwise you have to recreate back over there right so now once it is done uh, maybe you can go over uh, uh, the train model and then copy the token okay so for my to worry about any other set of things you can just say create training you can just say create training now it will take the data set it will take the token it will take the repo id uh, and then it will start training the model with respect to the dowlora so usually you should be able to see like uh, output like this so you will be like uh, running uh, so many set of information over here all set of uh, contents and all set of information would be running over here right based upon you can see right it is reading the images and it is processing the model saying like uh, all this uh, pr processing related part it will take it out okay so this will take like nearly like around uh, five to ten minutes uh, and once the model is trained you can start using the model out out okay well uh, which is called as uh, darwin and uh, i will show you like how the things it can be done so every 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 model i train uh, uh, the amount will be charged so i don't want it to have another model on the same name so i have already done that uh, training related part for my uh, name and just the name have been changed now i will do click on run trained model okay so once i click on run trained model uh, you have to be very uh, uh, clear that if you wanted to uh, say like uh, if you want to generate a photo like uh, i wanted a photo like uh, 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 photo of of darwin so here the keyword i have given is uh, darwin so photo of darwin in uh, space shuttle 
ओके इन स्पेस शटल इन वेरिंग स्पेस सूट okay so now i will not go and change any of the things since it is already nearly easy and related part i will just say enter okay so once i enter uh, it starts running the set of information based upon the uh, related aspects so now after it will also take a couple of uh, seconds maybe like 5 to 10 seconds it would take and it will generate a image immediately right so you can see like uh, uh, i am in the space shuttle uh, wearing a space suit uh, which is there as of now now i can go ahead and download this particular part now if you want to have a photo of maybe like uh, in a suit right so in a suit maybe uh, i can say in a suit with a tie i think this is mostly on marketing related part where uh, i can look elegant in uh, some of the things photo of darwin uh, wearing a suit maybe i have to specify as uh, wearing a suit with a tie let us see how it will come okay so now it will start uh, processing all the set of information and then it generates the image uh, uh, as i specified before so you can see it out uh, which is nearly matching it out uh, somehow <laughs> i don't know my head looks like little bit of bulge but it it is getting trained based upon the previous images so this is one of the things maybe i will also uh, specify another way i will say like uh, uh, wearing a iron man suit right iron man suit so let us see how this works okay so this is more of like uh, uh, training the model and then generating the images based upon the related part right great so however i think uh, it looks it looks more realistic uh, and then i think uh, yeah nice i can say like it's more i can really imagine myself over here and then uh, think of the texture and all those things were really good so now i will say like something different uh, maybe i will say like uh, photo of darwin um uh having having a coffee with uh, uh maybe like uh having a coffee on sunday in starbucks Starbucks wearing casuals with friends. Okay, so this is something where a scene has been created over here, right? So let us see how how it will uh, uh, behave now. Okay, great, great. So you can also ha have uh, different aspects. You can generate uh, one on one or uh, sixteen dot one or any of the things. So it looks good. So I can see like, oh my God, it so looks so nice. <laughs> great, great. Okay. So this is one of the things I'm just downloading everything because every photo is uh, paid, right? I've paid money for every photo. And yeah, that's it. I think you can uh, experiment out from your side also and share your uh, comments on the same. Thanks all.